First, we will show how to set up the Ferminator for an ordinary 32 liter fermenter bucket. We recommend to buy a stainless steel bottom plate as extra in order to protect the bottom of the Ferminator. Attach the temperature probe to the back of the fermenter with a piece of sticky tape. It is a good idea to isolate the probe with an isolating material in order to get an exact temperature measure of the beer as possible and not of the air around the fermenter. Place the front piece of the Ferminator in its right place. Please pay attention that the temperature probe cable is not sticking out or stuck somewhere. Attach the power supply and press the cable into the cable track. If you plan to use a taller fermenter like Firmzilla or other, the Ferminator can be expanded with expansion modules. Open the box carefully without sticking the knife into the box. Again, make sure the cable tracks on the modules fit the tracks on the bottom piece. Finally, place the front piece of the Ferminator in its right place and carefully press the pieces together. Please pay attention that the temperature probe cable is not sticking out or stuck somewhere. Attach the power supply and press the cable into the cable track. Turn on the power and set the Ferminator according to the recipe. Here is now shown how a Ferminator is constructed around a Firmzilla 35 liters. 
In order to make the ferminator and your fermenter mobile, it is a good idea to acquire a brew trolley so you can move both ferminator and fermenter around without heavy lifting. Again, make sure the cable tracks on the modules fit the tracks on the bottom piece.